Fatima Zart show and a happy new year to you all. It's 2017, can you believe it? Wow, it's already 2017 and we've waved goodbye to 2016. What a year it has been. I have been releasing weekly episodes in 2016. That was my promise when I started 2016 and I have stuck to my promise. I did release weekly episodes and if I ever had a week where I did not release an episode I try to not feel too guilty about it because I am trying my very best to release weekly episodes and I'm doing something I really love so I want to continue to do um, something I really enjoy and I really love which is creating content for YouTube in 2017 yesterday me and the kids were creating vision boards if you do not know what a vision board is it's a board that you create by using maybe bits of newspaper, magazine, uh, images that you can cut out, any sort of things or scraps that you have lying around that symbolize your vision for the future, for what you want to achieve. So what do you want to achieve in 2017? And also, you can also put down your future goals. And the idea of a vision board is you hang it up in your room or you hang it up in a part of your house where you will constantly look at it. It could be even the fridge door. And this will be your vision and your motivation to achieve the things that you've set out to achieve. And um, first off, I was just gonna create a vision board for myself, but then the kids were like, we wanna do one as well. So then I was like, okay, that would be great actually. It's good to kind of teach them to always have goals in life and um, always have a vision of what they want to achieve. So I let them create um, their own vision boards. Okay, so this is my vision board for 2017 and also for the future. I'll just go through it very quickly to explain to you what I have done. So, um, where shall I start? Um, so yeah, so here we've got um, some money and a lovely plant growing from the money. I want to obviously be better at saving money and this year and I know that if I save money I can create so much um, and I can create better content for YouTube, I can do the, my dreams and maybe buy a property and fulfill a lot of my dreams. So. The first goal I have is to save money. The second goal I have is to obviously be successful, continue being successful and do my very best on YouTube, continue to work hard on YouTube. I have another channel as I've said previously, it's called Anything Fatima and I absolutely love this channel because it's a vlogging channel. Can you see that? Yes, you can. It's a vlogging channel and I absolutely love it because I could just put any, anything un sort of art related on this YouTube channel Anything Fatima and I feel like I haven't given this channel enough um, time and dedication and I started it and I was really you know I was really excited to start that channel and then I didn't really work as hard as I wanted because Fatima's art show is my main channel so if you're not subscribed to this channel do subscribe to it because I promise in 2017 I'll be releasing weekly episodes on that channel the other thing that I want to be successful in is, if some of you might have seen my previous episodes, um, I started a company called Messy Cutie, which is art packs for children. And I want to really work hard to build this company and make it successful. So um, I'm going to be starting, um, the website is going to be live actually. So once the website is live and I get more of my stock, I will be advertising more. Another thing are these hearts that I've cut out and I've cut them out from the scraps I made in a previous episode where I showed how to use a palette knife. I really love painting, I love creating artwork and I don't want to forget that in 2017 and for the future. I want to continue to do my best to do the thing I love the most which is creating artwork and being an artist. So I wanna show myself more as an artist as well on my channel and not just do how-to videos. I also wanna show my ability to create artwork and my love to create artwork. Um, so that's something that I wanna sort of nurture, let's say. So um, I've got these lovely hearts there. 
Another thing which is kind of the most goal that people make in 2017 and every single year actually, not just 2017, they make a goal to be healthy, to lose weight, to take to get rid of all the extra pounds. What my aim is, is not to lose weight. Losing weight is not something I want to do, but if it happens, that's great, because my aim is to just be more healthy, live a more healthy lifestyle, and just eat healthy food and exercise. So, of course, here I've got be healthy, be happy, because of course, if you're dieting, you're not happy, you're just dieting. But if, well most people are not happy because they're, they're restricting themselves from eating the things they want and then they end up not happy and not satisfied. What I want to do is just be healthy and be happy. So throughout uh, my journey to be healthy, I want to also be happy. So then we got that. So these are the things that I really really look forward to doing in 2017 and in the future these are my goals I hope you enjoyed looking at those um, so maybe that gives you an idea of the sort of visions that you might have and makes you kind of really think about the sort of visions that you could put down when you create your own vision board if that's something you want to do if you don't want to create a vision board like a visual vision board you can you can just simply just write down your visions you don't have to actually physically make something that you hang up on to the wall you can write down your visions you could do a photoshop version if you if you use photoshop or any sort of photo editing software you can create your own sort of vision vision digitally and just very quickly, I'm going to show you my kids one because it is very different than mine. Um, and it's, they're just super cute. You know, they love making it. So let me show you theirs. So <laughs> this is my son's vision board. Da -da -da. So um, he wants to get fit. He also wants to be rich. This is the thing that he said. So they stuck it down. And then I asked them, what does it mean? And then I wrote it down for them. So he apparently wants to be rich. He wants to get fit and he wants to do YouTube. So you can tell that they actually love and enjoy creating YouTube videos with me. It's not something that I've just told them to do. They just love it. And he wants to be a footballer. He said, that's actually the first thing I, he said when I said to him, what do you want to do? What is your vision? He said to me, mum, I want to be a footballer and he stuck um, football and apparently he likes Chelsea so he told me specifically to find a picture of a Chelsea player which I did I don't know what's that on his head but yes uh, Chelsea player stuck there and the other thing he wants is he wants to go to a place called Peppa Pig World which is in the UK and because he loves uh, the cartoon Peppa Pig so he wants to um, go see that so that's his vision this is my daughter's vision again she loves creating videos for youtube and it's something that they they really love doing so they want to make more youtube she wants to make more youtube videos with me and the other thing that she's been telling me she wants is her own desk her own workspace and um to basically for me to get her or for her to save up and buy a desk where she could do her work and she could work hard Another one she also wanted is to um, get fit, to exercise, and her and my son both agreed on that. They also agreed on being rich. They both said they want to be rich, so they put it down there. And then she's put a lovely, beautiful heart because um, she's just such an amazing girl with a big heart, and I think she just wants to spread, spread her love to everyone around her so these are my kids vision boards and we really enjoyed creating these vision boards and i hope you enjoy creating yours if that's something you're planning to do i just once again want to wish everybody a wonderful 2017 and i want to wish you all the best from the bottom of my heart to you and um I also want to know what sort of episodes you want to see in 2017 on my channel so do let me know, write it down in the comment section below what sort of episodes you want to see. I also, I always love feedback 
and I also want to I always want to know what you think so please let me know all right then take care of yourself as always thank you for watching bye